Good morning, guys. Good morning from Alton Towers. No, we're not at Lightopia. Today we are at a private event because I am at a running event um, with Run Through, it's called. A company that I found through the internet and through social media and do lots and lots of organised runs. I've done one of their runs at Altrium, which is fabulous. And today we're at Alton Towers and I'm doing the half marathon around Alton Towers. Yesterday they did a 5k and a 10k. Look where I am today. How cool is this? Lots and lots of Christmas stuff um, for the Lightopia Festival, but I am really excited. Looks like it's going to be a lovely day. It's quite chilly this morning, so it's November, um, but really excited about doing it. I haven't been running for a while just due to some medical issues, so I'm going to take it easy and take you with us. Let's have a look what's going on. So just waiting for the race to the start. We're on the grass area. Um, Normally where the big stage is at Alton Towers, there's some music playing. I think we're doing a warm-up here about half nine and then the start line is over there. Directions so far haven't been great. I think I'll just follow the crowd though. That's probably the best thing to do. Lots of people here this morning. The elite runners are coming through as we're just waiting to go. And I'm stood behind a unicorn. And we're up. Really great to see. Press fit JC. Great stuff. High five already. And we start uphill. Of course we do. The theme of this half marathon is going to be uphill. I have never been around this part. I always wonder what the stargazing gods were. be brutal but it definitely is back in the park now only mile six really that'll do it all again <laughs> i do this for fun you know Another one to go. Oh one more round. Okay. Woo! Bye. Bye. Keep going. Woo! One mile to go. 
I don't know why I was smoke this year. This is a slippy hard run. Especially when you've been out of training for almost a month. Almost there. Keep going until I see the finish. Now, excuse the heavy breathing. We're going around in the section where there's 13 from Rita. How cool is this? How cool is it? So wobbly footage. Put things in it, Jackson. Don't open up. Having some finishes coming through now. So there's a couple more coming down the hill there, as you can see. Now I am not running this hill. Almost at the top. Right by Nemesis. Oh. This is definitely, definitely hard work. Still smiling, just. Last bit. Bit of time. He's not far away at all. And this bit's downhill. I can see it. kids had a quick snack bar kind snack bar which was great i am starting to get really cold now because i am very very sweaty sorry i'm just gonna head to the toilets now and try and have a wash um, and dry off a little bit because um, the these lot want to ride some rides which apparently they've done already I've been with the they've been on a spin ball with it which is fine i don't blame them there was a lot of time when I was out in the car park and these guys weren't able to get anywhere else apart from the middle section. Long time. Oh, right. I wasn't trying to say I was slow. You run then. Not a chance. I'd be in the back of that ambulance. So we're going to go get changed and then come out of the toilet for new me. So we have just got off the runaway mine train. It was a walk on. And how many times did we go around? We went round three times. Jew, Jew. We asked for a fall, but she said we were being greedy. Heading off to Nemesis and Galactica. God, I can't think straight right now. Um, zero wait times for most of the rides right now, or five. Pokemon's 35 minutes, but that is in the center, so not to be expected. Let's see what we can get on. Nemesis is a walk on, and we didn't have to go up the hill. Black bits closed, we're just going around here. I think it was definitely worth the spectator tickets for this. that question 
No retro squad. All gone. Retro squad is no more, and I saw one in the X sector that while well, I was running, that has also gone as well. So I wonder what's going to replace it next year, whether they'll be coming back or not. Who knows? But they definitely won't be here for Christmas. So it's been a great afternoon here at Alton Towers. We're not finished yet, have we? No, apparently. Um, it's only three o'clock in the afternoon. The park is pretty much empty. Um, not empty enough that it doesn't have any atmosphere. It's got lots of atmosphere, but the rides are pretty much a walk on. The most of the wait is about 20 meters, 20 meters, 20 minutes for Rita. But that's because someone dropped their hat or their glasses and they have to go and collect all their medals. And they have to go and collect it. Um, not sure what we're doing now. Even Wickerman's a zero minute wait. So these lot want coffee and a cake. Donut? Donuts. They want donuts. Yes. Let's go and get some donuts, get some sugar. Not. And well your jokes are terrible. You know that, don't you? You've got such bad dad jokes. I don't know. Dad jokes. Yes you do. That's a dad joke, Harry. Right, let's go get some donuts. A game of battle galleons in the winter. Brave souls going on that, I tell you. Totally brave souls. Well, those donuts were delicious. And when it's five, oh, sorry, pounds are allowed. And when it's five for six pounds or ten for seven, we have to go with ten. Uh, the kids have just nicked on, <laughs> popped on the wicker man while we have just finished our coffees. Um, gonna go on Wicker Man with them again, so we'll do it again because there's a zero wait time. Then I think we're heading to Spinball Wizard and then maybe home. I think that's gonna be the plan for the rest of the afternoon. Just headed on the Wicker Man. Look at the queue! There's nobody in the queue. You're having a boogie there. I've already done it. You've already done it once, haven't you? Yeah, we just did it. Literally nobody <laughs> in the queue. Oh no, people coming. Move it, move it, move it. Just got off the wicker van. How many times did you go on it? Three. Three times for Harry and twice for us. We actually left our bags in the bag drop and just kept carried on walking around and went on again. Front row though, with Dad and Emily, yeah. which was quite really cool. But look how empty the place is. Honest to God, it's really crazy it's how highway. empty the place. Oh, Smilo's open. Yeah, we were. And that would be lovely if Smilo's open. Yeah, literally everything that is now a walk on. Wickerman got up to about 30 minutes before when we were having our lunch. Didn't go on it then and then just jumped on it now. But Smiler walk on would be amazing. I know. Going on to Oblivion now and then onto Spinball Wizard and then I think we're going home then. Okay. It's um, about half past four, but the park doesn't shut for another two hours. Well, the rides don't shut for another two hours. So it shut about quarter to seven and the park is open till quarter to eight, which is not bad for a private event like this. Um, but like I said, I think two more rides for us and then the monorail home because I am not walking back to that car park. So just got off Oblivion and Spinball Wizard. A bit, dizzy, a bit dizzy now. Had an awesome day here at Alton Towers today. The run was super hard, but well worth it. And the medal is amazing. Um, so I'm grateful just to do it for that. But the price of the tickets, so the kids, the spectator tickets, etc., has been well worth it. It's just been a fabulous day here at Alton Towers. Heading home, it looks a lot later than it is. It's just five o'clock in the evening, but they've got the Christmas decks up. Um, thanks for watching guys, don't, give, don't forget give us a big thumbs up, it really really helps the channel. Leave any comments down below, 
apologies I've gone into the dark and I'll see you again in the next one bye